Saskatchewan RCMP have shared a detailed timeline of Canada's deadliest mass stabbing. Here's what we know happened on September 4th last year. Miles and Damien Sanderson drove a stolen van to a house on James Smith Cree Nation. Miles Sanderson attacked a man with a pair of scissors. Police say Damien Sanderson broke up the fight and told the injured man not to call police until the brothers left. Miles took a knife from the kitchen as they fled. The Sanderson brothers started fighting while driving away. Damien escaped from the van and fled to some nearby bushes. His body was found there a day later. Miles continued alone and crashed the van into the front of a house. He attacked Robert Sanderson and another man. Miles ran to a house down the street where he attacked a man and woman. Then he attacked Christian and Lana Head and stole Christian's truck. Miles eventually abandoned the truck and walked to another house, attacking Bonnie and Gregory Burns and two boys. Miles then stole an SUV and drove to a house where he attacked Earl Burns Sr. and a woman. Miles drove away and Earl Burns pursued in a school bus. Police found the bus in a ditch with Earl Burns' body inside. Miles made it to a house where he attacked Thomas and Carol Burns and two other men. Miles attacked multiple people before returning to Edward Burns Avenue. There, he attacked Bonnie Burns again and Lydia Gloria Burns. He drove out of the community in a stolen vehicle at 7 a.m. In the village of Weldon, Miles stopped at the home of Wesley Peterson and attacked him on his porch, making him the 11th homicide victim.